um, there was a tweet that came out uh, from one championship. <clears throat> yeah. Uh, from one about, or from Arjun? Uh, it came out from, uh, looks like one. Oh, one, one asked who, who they should yeah. have, who, who would they would like to have him sign next, correct? Yeah, yeah. And then Stipe kind of um, gave like the little question mark emoji and then... Um, and then uh, Arjun, Smith, uh, Arjun Singh came out and um, said, you know, basically taunted Stipe. Um, and so it's just kind of interesting that, you know, there's all the speculation that Stipe might sign me one. Well, I mean, he's not happy there. He hasn't been happy there for the longest time. And I understand why. And as much as I like to, ra- I, everyone thinks I like to rag on Stipe, I've said the reasons why is that the UFC didn't like him. They didn't really care for him as their champion. Because he complained about a lot of things vocally and he was very public about it. And then he also didn't want to fight sometimes. He's like, yeah, I'm going to sit this out or I'm going to take some time. That is a champion. Like people just, the, the UFC doesn't care for that. No. Like once they you want, get to that level, to. they want to see you fight as much as possible so they can make, they can make money off you. And that's, and that wasn't ragging. I'm not trying to rag on him. I'm just being very honest from a promoter standpoint of what they were thinking. Like, hey, you're not, you're not really, you, you don't want to fight right now. Okay. Or you're busy doing this or. Or you just want to be champion for a while, but you don't want to fight. Well, we can't do anything with you being champion for a while. We need you to fight so we can make our money back. You know what I mean? Like they've put a lot of money into marketing you and then that's the deal. I really, I really love the idea of him going to one. And I think it's a phenomenal idea because um, I think it's good for these other promotions, all promotions to let their fighters there experience what it's like to fight someone who obviously has fought in the UFC because then they'll realize that you know what they're all just as I wouldn't say they're all just as good but some of them are yeah. you know and so um I I think Stipe going over there would be would be a very eye-opening situation but he's not going there for at least two fights he just lost his he just lost his title hello he's got a two-fight extension hello so I get what Stipe is saying but let's just remember now that he's done this publicly they will not they will wait to fight him <laughs> <laughs> they will wait as long as they can. Plus, on top, on top of his contract running out, like after he fights two fights, he has like another probably 90-day or 120-day. 90-day. Day. Yeah, 90-day 90 uh, yeah. extension on there. It says he, he yeah, has he, to he only strictly only negotiate, negotiate with, with them. them. So, I mean, you're looking at two more years. 